My name is Chris Fawcett. I'm a Steadicam operator and I've developed the ExoVest uh, for TIFF and Steadicam. ExoVest is different from other vests in the way that it deals with the load and the torque going into the body. For example, the load goes into four places via these four pads here that correspond to where the pelvic bones rise to the surface. So there's no pressure on the abdomen, there's no pressure on the base of the spine, and also there's no pressure on the sides where the gluteus muscles attach to the iliac crest. So it's putting the weight into the right places. It's also putting the torque into a very high spot. Instead of having chest straps that come around at this level and put the torque in at a low level, this raises the torque lever arm to very high up between your shoulder blades, which is the same place that your body resists torque. When you pick up something in your arms, it's resisted at the level of the shoulder blades. So you have a much longer lever. It's like grabbing a hammer at the very top to pull out a nail instead of halfway down. So, I'll stick the vest on. You'll see how it goes. Gauge is here at the waist. Now, the vest also has a lot of room up front so that if I have to stun a running shot, I've got plenty of room to breathe. I've got no restriction and that's not going to influence the shot. Now the other great thing about the vest is that it has pivots here and here, which is at the same level that the pelvis pivots. So when you walk, you do not have to maintain a level pelvis like you would with most Steadicam vests. With this vest, you just let your pelvis move naturally and the vest moves with your pelvis. That allows you to be much more relaxed in a shot. It also means you're using less tension so you're more stable. It's just less work all round. And they have the same pivot at the top, here and here, but this time at the axis of the shoulder girdle. So that if you're operating in low mode, low mode is a situation when one hand is higher, much higher than the other, that you don't have all the weight on one shoulder, that the weight is equally placed. So that's just a simple description. If you want to find out any more about it, just go to steadycam.com, have a look there. You can download the user manual, read all about it. Thanks.